Councillor Cordova. Thank you very much, Mayor. I'd like to start by thanking Councillor Street for uh, making that suggestion, and I will uh, follow suit by supporting a, a foreshadowed motion if, it, uh, if this were to fail. So the, my reasons for thinking this are that the proposed extension area is adjacent to a currently serviced area, and it's likely that the contractor would be able to provide a service to that area if required. There is no cost to Council if the collection service is not extended. But equally, if Council decided to extend the service, the costs to the Council, the costs of the Council's curbside waste and recycling services would be recovered by service charges and factored into Council's annual budget. I am aware, I am cognizant to the, the points that Councillor Fox made, and I, I think they are good ones. Um, I think it lends weight to the idea that we should at least ask the residents what they want and what they feel about it. But most importantly, even if there are some people who would prefer not to have it or some people who would prefer to have it, that's almost immaterial because when you look at the environment section at 6.1, the following environmental benefits would accrue to the entire municipality and indeed the state were we to extend collection services wider than they're currently um, provisioned. So that is, we would reduce our greenhouse gas emissions, we would improve recycling rates and diversion of product to landfill, and we would discourage illegal littering. And I think that that's a jolly good thing to do. So I will be voting against this and I hope that we can uh, move Councillor Street's motion. Thank you.